Figgy boy makes sense everyone has their own limitations and ethics with investing 100 and that is key again uh, draw a line uh, to where you you're not really interested in investing in don't just because that way you add a little depth to your investments it means you're not just chasing money all right because when you're just chasing money you might come across a situation where you're in conflict with your ethics because you're only chasing money so you're blindsided by the ethics of that investment and that'll uh, cause you to make mistakes and one of the first rules of investing is preserve capital okay if you can prevent yourself from losing 20 percent okay that's equivalent to gaining 25 percent let's say right and the reason I say that is this assume you have a hundred dollars right let's say your hundred dollar investment goes down uh, to eighty dollars right so you just lost twenty percent of your money right twenty percent of your investment is gone now assume you invest eighty dollars and the stock goes up or your investment goes up to a hundred dollars that's a twenty dollar increase on an eighty dollar investment the same dollar amount but from 80 to 80 to 100 dollars is a 25 percent increase right so if you're losing capital 20 percent capital right you have to gain back from a hundred dollar investment you have to gain back 25 percent on an 80 dollar investment to go back to where you were even steven right so preserving capital gives you a bigger yield than making capital that's the same right if you lose 20 percent in one investment and gain 20 percent another investment of equal value the gains are not the same you're still overall down right so one of the first rules of investment and there are many first rules of investment one of the first rules of investment or mantras of investment is preserve capital okay so that means you don't want to get blindsided with an internal conflict you might have because you'll make the wrong decision.